Hi Mouseketeers, welcome back to my channel. Princess Minnie here with another Disney pin video. And I'm very excited about this one, but before we get into that, I just wanted to share my shirt with you. Um, in case you're wondering what it is. It is a Game of Thrones shirt, and it says Watchers on the Wall. Any other Game of Thrones fans here? I'm a, I'm, I, I'm in like multiple fandoms. I love Disney. I love Game of Thrones. I love so many things. So let me know if you are also eagerly awaiting another year for the final finale, like series finale of Game of Thrones. Big fan. So I just wanted to share that with you. But what we're really here for today is I have a big package for you. And this is from the eBay seller Save Some More. And I can highly recommend this seller. I have bought several things from this eBay seller and I have 100% satisfaction personally. And I think they have almost 100% satisfaction if not exactly 100% on their site. I, can ask, I, I really don't know what's in here. I know that it is the equivalent of 50 pins and I can feel some booster sets in here because I feel the cardboard backings. But I won an eBay auction and it was the seller's choice. You were guaranteed 50 pins, but they could be booster sets or mystery bags. I don't, I don't know what I'm getting. I'm really, I'm really excited. This is like, I feel like mystery bags are so exciting because you don't know what you're gonna get. And this is like a giant mystery bag of 50 pins. Now I have a lot of booster sets already if you watched previous videos, so I'm kind of hoping I don't get a lot of doubles, but I mean if I do, traders, so look for what you like because I might trade with you. Okay, it is nicely packaged, so if you are going to sell Disney pins, you need to package your pins nicely in bubble wrap. I mean, this person went, you know, above and beyond, this seller went above and beyond because they're still in booster pack packages or mystery bags but they went the, the second step with bubble wrap but if you are going to just send the individual pins you need to do it with bubble wrap because that protects the pin and, it, and otherwise that the envelope that you send it in will be completely torn up with, by the pin back so just don't do that send correctly Anyway, so I'm gonna open this up. I can already tell a few things that are in here and I'm pretty excited, but holy crap, there is a lot in here. So it looks like there are mostly one, two, three, four, five, six, seven booster sets. And I can already tell I already have some of them, but whatever. Um, then they're gifts or they're traders, and that's great. Or for crafts projects, I suppose. And I have two mystery pin bags in here. So right away, that's 10 pins and I'm gonna show them to you quickly, is the Disney Couples Pack, which I'm very excited because I have six of these already and I really wanna to try to get most of the set, if not the whole thing, and then a Star Wars Pack. So you'll get to see me open those in just a minute. Um, I'm really excited about both of these, to be quite honest. So I'm gonna put this to the side. All right, let's look and see what we have in terms of boosters. I hope that I get at least one or two new ones, but I got these at a crazy good discount, less than $2 per pin, so. Now this one, I already have this one. It is the Avengers pin set. I'm not gonna take it out of the plastic. I have shown this one on my channel already. Um, I'm not a huge Avengers fan. I am going, you know, I I guess by the point this, by the time this video is already up, I will have seen the new Avengers movie. Um, it's part of my birthday weekend, because I do like the Avengers, but I kind of wish the Guardians of the Galaxy characters were on here because they're my favorite Avengers. I mean, they count as Avengers. They're Avengers, right? I mean, they're in, in Infinity Wars. So, I like... I, these are really nice pins. I have them already, and I'm not that psyched about them to begin with. So they'll be great traders. All right, what's next? I'm going to pick one at random. <laughs> Anybody who watched my very first video will know why I'm laughing about this. Star Wars symbols. I have a million Star Wars symbols. And if you were curious as to what some of these symbols are, go back and watch my first video because they're in there. But I mean, retail, $30. The Avengers was also $30. I didn't pay much more than that combined, so I'm already making out on the deal. <gasps> oh my god! Oh, I'm so excited about this one! One of my favorite Pixar movies. Wally. Wally. Eva. 
they're here, both of them. And I wanted the Niddle Lolly so bad for a Valentine's Day board. And so I don't need all of these Wallies, although I do really like the, the, the worrying panicky one. I don't need all of these, so some of them will be traders and some of them I will be keeping. Probably two of the Wallies and one or two of the Eves, Eves and then the other ones will be traders. That's really exciting. To me, that, and, and what was the price on that one? That alone, $30. That's about, um, that's just under half of what I paid for all of these pins. Again, great eBay seller. You gotta look out for auctions. If you just buy, I mean, you're still gonna probably get a good deal, but if you're really willing to stay up late at night or you have really early in the morning and win those auctions, you can do it. Um, another one I already have, but a very popular character, so I think good for trading in the park, Stitch. And again, another one that's $30. Okay, another one I have, not that surprising, I do have a lot of booster packs. Um, they're little cutesy Disney princesses. Again, 30 bucks, like what? I, 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 come on. Okay, one I did not have, and I could not decide whether or not I really wanted to buy this booster pack, so it was decided for me. Seller's Choice, the Haunted Mansion Tsum Tsum series. So I'm definitely going to keep this, and I am, I have a couple other Haunted Mansion pins. I'm growing my Haunted Mansion collection. At the very least, this will become a Halloween pin board. And again, $30. Uh, so, you know, you can't go wrong with winning an auction. That includes all these pins. Finally, oh my god, I have never even seen this booster pack before. 25 bucks. This is phenomenal. I saw in the back it said Disney Cruise Line, and I thought, I don't think I've ever seen any packs from the Disney Cruise Line. Have you seen these? I have never seen these before. I'm going to give you a little bit more of a close-up. You got Stitch, it's one of my faves, and look at the cute anchor that they're all on. I love the motif. And um, Mickey, Chip and Dale in cute little sailor outfits, and Daisy, who is one of my faves as well. And I, I honestly think that this could be a great summer board, like a, like a July or August theme maybe. I've never been on a Disney cruise. I probably won't ever go on a Disney cruise. I'm not into cruising. But if you've been on a Disney cruise and you are obsessed with it, you got to let me know. Maybe you'll change my mind. I know I'm obsessed with these pins. These are not traitors. So sorry if you kind of wanted them. You're going to have to get them on your own. 25 bucks. Four pins. No, I probably, on average, I probably paid two a dollar seventy five for each of these pins. Okay. So the seller also included the two mystery bags, and I think that I'm more excited about the couples pack. So I'm gonna go with the Star Wars Tsum Tsum Series One pack, and I'll quickly show you on the back. So this is a close up of the front. And then on the back, it shows you all of the different Tsum Tsum characters you can get. Now, I do feel like I like Tsum Tsums, Tsum Tsum pins, but I feel like the detail on them can make them very hard to tell sometimes who the characters are. So I'm going to do my best to identify the characters I get. Hopefully they'll be really obvious ones. If I'm wrong, sorry, correct me below. I'm happy to take that feedback uh, because I, I want to know what pins I have too. It kind of would be helpful if they could like write it on the back instead of giving you this little, like, box, because is anybody really checking these off as you get them? Maybe people do. Tell me if you do that, because I never even occurred to me. I don't even think I noticed that box before right now. I think it would be really helpful if they just included a little hint as to who each character was, because some of them are really obvious and some of them not so much. Okay, first pin. I know who this is, and he's one of my faves. I feel like he's one of everybody's faves. It's our boy. Darth Vader. And that's all I have to say about that. Darth Vader. Great first pull. Who's going to join him? Who's going to join the dark side? Is it going to be another bad guy? No, it's not. It's everybody's favorite droid. Well, I don't know. BB-8 might have stolen some of his spotlight, but... I think this is a super cute Tsum Tsum of R2-D2. I'm very excited to have classic Star Wars characters. I really love him. And I think he he does look very detailed in Tsum Tsum form. So, no doubt, R2-D2. 
third one. Oh, we got another um, light side, I guess. <laughs> I've never heard anybody say that before. Um, the light side of the force, I guess. It is Obi-Wan Kenobi when well, he's old. So original trilogy. So I like the theme that I'm getting so far. I don't know if, if I just saw this pin, I'd be that psyched about it because like it's just, it's just like an old guy. But I think in context with the other Star Wars Tsum Tsums, pretty cool. But again, if you just saw this and did not know this was Star Wars, would you know this is Obi-Wan Kenobi? And if you say yes, I don't know. I don't know if I believe you. Pretty good though. Okay, two more. I kind of want to get another bad guy. I, I don't know. I identify with the Sith and the bad guys, I guess. No such luck, but it is one of the most amazing Star Wars characters of all time. Although he kind of doesn't look that impressed to be a pin. Yoda, doesn't he just, he kind of looks just like, ugh, why am I here? I'm, su I'm super tired. I'm just going to like vanish into the force. But he's really cute. And I like his color. Alright, so that's Three good guys, one bad guy. <sighs> Can we get some balance? Can we get some, some dark side energy here? Yes, we did! Okay, that worked! Boba Fett. He is looking super cool. I know, like, people are absolutely obsessed with Boba Fett. I don't get why people are obsessed with him. Because I don't really feel like he's... I don't know, in that much of the movies. Maybe I'm wrong, but I do love how much detail's on him and how much you can know right away, hey, that's Boba Fett. Because again, one of my problems with the Tsum Tsums is they are not always uh, instantly identifiable, but he is, so I'm very excited about that. Awesome Star Wars pack. And this is the first official Star Wars pack I've opened, but I have gotten a few individuals and no doubles so far. So, psyched about that. Final moment of the video. Now this is where I could get in trouble because I just, if I had known what I was going to get in that last pack, I would have saved that for last. <sighs> because I've been having really bad luck opening these packs because I've been getting so many doubles. When I opened um, Disney Wor World of Evil packs, I got the exact same mystery pack and I don't even know how it's possible. Like the odds against that have to be really high. So I'm going to show you. This is the front, and of course it's everybody's flat, a classic favorite couple. Although maybe, I don't know, maybe you're a Daisy and Donald couple. I do like them. Um, because I'm hot-tempered and crazy like Donald is, and my husband's way more even-killed like Daisy is. We're not as nice as Mickey and Minnie and sweet. But um, let me show you the back and see all the couples you can get. And I'm going to go over the ones that I have already. I do believe I have Mickey and Minnie. I have the Queen and King of Hearts from Alice in Wonderland. I have Belle and the Beast, which I feel like is a very popular one, so I feel very lucky to have them. I have uh, Tiana and the Frog Prince Naveen, Prince Naveen. Um, I have Cinderella and Prince Charming. And I th oh, and I have Rapunzel and Flynn Rider. So the ones that I would really like in this pack have got to be Ariel and Eric. They're one of my favorite couples. I'm trying to actually start a Lady in the Tramp side collection, so that would be a really good thing. I actually wouldn't even mind if if I opened another pack of these in the future and I got two Ladies in the Tramp. I have one couple collection and one Lady in the Tramp collection. I wouldn't mind um, the um, Robin Hood couple, Robin Hood and Maid Marian. I like them. Oh, I just realized I have this one too. It's um, Peter Pan and Tink. I don't really think of them as a couple, so I'm not going to include them in my couples board that I'm making that I'll show you guys. That's kind of weird to me. I know she wants to be a couple with him, but he's like a little boy, right? So weird. That's kind of creepy. They shouldn't be in this pack, in my opinion. <laughs> um, and then I actually would also really like Jasmine and Aladdin, but I, I just hope I don't get any doubles with this. If I do, I think that these are pretty popular. I think I'll be able to trade them. But I'd love to get some of the ones that I don't already have. I just got this so fancy. Like, it's just like a little curve. I don't know. I just had to do that. <sighs> okay. It's a double. And it's one I already have. And it's the one that I think does not belong in this pack whatsoever because it's Peter Pan and Tink. And I, I'm just going to say it. I'm going to call my shot. I think that's creepy. I think that's weird that they're on this in the couples category. Um, so I have two. 
Anybody want it? <laughs> I will hi I will happily trade you this pin. Okay. I hope that's not indicative of what this entire pack's gonna be like for me, that I'm gonna be like, mm, okay, I have it or whatever. Uh-oh, I have this one too. It is the King and Queen of Hearts. But here's why I actually don't mind getting this double. I think that they look perfect for a Valentine's board, and I'm going to have a couple's board that I just keep up probably year-round, and so now I can have one on each board. There you go. I don't have to take one off to furnish the other board. Not the worst double to get, actually. They're weird, though. There's another weird couple. She's, like, normal size, and he's very, like, comically little compared to her. I haven't seen that movie in a really long time, Alice in Wonderland, so I actually don't even remember the King of Hearts. The Queen of Hearts is very memorable, but I don't think he is, so I don't know. It's another double. And again, I can always throw these all onto a Valentine's Day pin board as well and not have to take them off my couple's pin board. Um, but it's it's uh, Tiana and Prince Naveen in their frog form, and this is a super cute pin, so I am excited that you're getting a chance to see it. There we go. What was it? Three? So I have two pins left. Well, I just looked in and I saw it and I know I'm really, really excited. It's Ariel and Eric. Oh, thank God. That's probably my favorite Disney couple. Look at this pin. I am in love with this pin. The detail on it, the colors. The colors are so 80s, aren't they? I love it. Because this movie came out, I think, the year I was born. And so I've always really liked this movie, and to me they just always seemed like couple goals. Okay. Final pin. Please, 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 don't be a double, don't be a double, don't be a double. I guess if I say that I think it's going to actually matter. It's a double. Guys, I had every single one of these except Ariel and Eric. I wish that was the last one I pulled out. But that being said, if I was going to get doubles, it's a great, great, great double to get. Again, I can put it on lots of different boards, or I think this would be a popular trader because it's Belle and the Beast. And I think I've seen a lot of people want this pin. So if you want it, let me know. Whew, that was a long one. That was a lot of pins. I mean, I, I know that most of them were in booster packs and we didn't look at them individually, but that's 50 pins. Um, so my collection is ever growing. And I hope to see you on uh, the on Facebook and Disney Kitties pin group. You can comment below. Let's talk trades. Let's talk about pins you like. Comment below what was your favorite um, pack in this series. Was it the couples pack? Was it maybe the Haunted Mansion booster pack? What did you like? I want to hear from you. See what's popular out there. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. I'll see you real soon.